Hello everybody, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption on the PS4. Thanks for clicking on this video. Kicking off with it. This dude, Dickens, I can't remember his name. Uh, mission. There's lots of videos you could have clicked on and you clicked on this one. For that, I am eternally appreciative. Hopefully, hopefully, you enjoy the content and the gameplay that's about to come Mr. your Marston, way. Sir, John Marston. Mr. Marston, don't be so childish. Come on, sir, I implore you. Okay, okay, okay. So I made a few innocent mistakes when last we met. If, but my plan is still sound. Together we can conquer, if not the world, then certainly Bill Williamson. But first, do you need me to do you a favor? <laughs> you read my mind. <laughs> I can only deduce. You've been taking my tonic, sir, as instructed. It can give the most ordinary of sure, intelligences dish. a remarkable insight. I'll give you insight. I'll show you what your guts look like. Please, Gross. sir, this show of petulance is nothing short of kind of cool. Think for a moment, sir. Think. I'm thinking about how much of my time you're wasting. <laughs> um, sir. Sir. I am about to do something. Which I greatly discourage in all wise and rational men. A selfless act. For you. Wow. But, sir, before I act selflessly... Allow me to act selfishly and sell some of my wares. Fair enough. Oh, good, sir. Come, and let's go visit some of our fine friends in the other oil business we have here in Plainview. These men need all the help they can get. Apologies, <laughs> we can hear some scratchy sounds in the background. My uh, gerb two gerbils are joining me for this tree for this uh, recording session, apparently. They're normally asleep at this time of the day, but today, today, they're like, you know what? We want to be here. We want to be digging. We want to be scratching. We want to be playing. Ladies and gentlemen, wow, that was mingling. Friends, hardworking souls of uh, playing view, do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, acute? Chronic sciatic, uh, neurologic, or inflammatory pain? Well, I represent the only company that makes the genuine article which cures headache, neuralgia. I don't like how they say genuine. <laughs> genuine, oh god. This man is a fucking charlatan. He just got done swindling us down at Cho Springs with this song and dance. I say we tar and feather him right now. <laughs> we shoot the bastard. I think it's time we take a business elsewhere. Uh, I just. I apologize if science is not your forte. Good day, what and all. Somebody get that thing back! Well, this sure is pleasant. Let's go, my boy. I think we've outstayed our welcome here. Go! Saint Homobonus is not so good. Oh, no. Who? Homobonus, the patron saint of Mr. Sam. I'd say he's doing you just a service. Oh, Poppycock! Those inmates were clearly informed of my refund policy. Go, 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 go. I include metaphor in every sense of the word, my dear boy. You leave the business to me, do I try to tell you how to rob banks? Robin Banks felt more honest than this. Sorry, Hoss. Oh, he's lost his hat. Let's go back for his hat. Yes, you got him. Well, that, 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 the guy took like four bullets. Can you drive a bit quicker? Well, it's one of our horses gone. Uh, Not the people I'm murdering. Well, it looks like the global expansion of your West Dickens elixir might have come across. Nonsense. Another bump on the science's rocky road. Oh, God. The 
This is a terrible misunderstanding! Look, they've got the road blocked up ahead! Uh, where's the Chris? Yes, it was. That's about what you've been promising them. Keep that gun at the ready, my dear boy. Can we drive a little bit quicker, please? For a man of people, you sure ain't very popular. I am up against the weight of plebeian ignorance, my boy. Maybe you need to think about a change of career. I will never give up on science, John. One less moron to worry about. Yeah, I mean, we're very, like, single-handedly reducing... We're single-handedly reducing the population of America. There's no miners left, there's no people in these oil workers, like, we're destroying the country. <laughs> There's still more. It's gonna take more than one of you. Come on. Keep your eye out, John. There's a sniper somewhere. There's a sniper somewhere. I can feel him. I can sense him. I can see him on the radar. I don't know where it's actually radar, but there's someone up there. Oh my. Show me your pretty little face. There it is. Didn't see his pretty little face. What do you want from me? You start to regret this yet? I mean, how far are they pursuing us? Like, Fine shot, my boy. Well, I know it was. I'm getting good at this now. I'm well practiced at killing people. <laughs> Is something big about to happen? Some evil. Well, that was a little hairy. Thank you, my dear boy. You saved the day again. Again. And again. And again. It always impresses me with the speed with which a group of men can turn from passive sheep into murderous wolves. I'm impressed with how you nearly got us killed back there. Well, Again. Yes, uh, perhaps we should shell the tonics business for a period. Let's say we try our hand at racing again. If there's a meet at Ratskeller. You're trying my patience, Mr. West Dickens. Well, I'm sorry, dear boy, but I'm only an aging vendor of exotic elixirs, not the bloody U.S. Cavalry. Forgive me if matters take some time to prepare. It's valid. Just all crooked. All crooked. Oh, where the hell am I? There's another mission here. Funny man. Funny man. Who's funny man? Let's do this mission. Mr. West Dickens! Ah, Mr. Marston! How wonderful to see you, sir. How wonderful. Are we ready, then? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, nearly, sir. Barely nearly, sir. I just need some cash to get some extra hardware fitted to my old Trojan horse here. You, you what? <laughs> Never mind, sir. I can only presume that you have not enjoyed the benefits of a classical education, so I will not take umbrage if some of my illusions sail over your head, sir. I won't pretend to understand you, but I will endeavor to make you understand me. Either we do this right now, or I put a bullet in you and get on with my day. Please, I knew you were a violent man, Mr. Marston, but I did not think you were a stupid one. We need money to outfit my carriage, to turn a simple tradesman's vehicle into something more 
subterfuge. <laughs> and I'm about to tell you how we are going to gain said cash. Let me guess, murder. I know that you ride very well. So come, sir, to Rathskeller Fork. <laughs> Let's go, my dear boy. I'll show you the way. Oh, okay. Um, come on. Gonna convert his carriage. How are you, John? Okay, all things considered, hopefully we can get through today without running into another army of your satisfied customers. Onwards and upwards! I refuse to let the blind stupidity of the proletariat derail my calling in life. Nothing <laughs> blind about it. I'd say they saw right through you. Ah, before knowledge comes down, my dear boy. Everybody knows you're as crooked as a dog's hind leg, Wes Dickens. I resent that implication, John. I wasn't implying. I was telling. If you're such a successful businessman, what are you doing living in a cave? Delightfully Dickensian, isn't it? If you say so, well, cheaper I'm on familiar rent. with the concept of philanthropy, John. I'm surprised you are. <laughs> I don't do any of this for myself, John. I hope you realize that. Mm, you're crazy, old right. man. You seem to be forgetting that I've been part of your ridiculous charade. It's been quite a ride, John, hasn't it? We haven't gone that far. No, I mean us. Bridgewood Farm, Gap Tooth Breach, Plainview. We make quite a team, you and me. Brains and brawn. I'm we both. consider oh. our permanent partnership. No. This partnership ends as soon as I have Bill Williamson. I appreciate your help, but I've just about had it with all your scheme. You need to realize what's at stake here. I know, John, I know. Just win this race. <laughs> the are going crazy. I just put the... Why describe as the good shit cardboard in the cage. Um, which is like thicker cardboard. You get, um... From like, um, like more sturdy cardboard boxes, so you know, like in the supermarkets, you'll have they'll um, sometimes have them out the front and they have like where they put like wine bottles in and stuff. Oh, they go, they go ape crap for it. They're like, Yes, this is what I want the good cardboard. All right, I just got mowed off the wall. One. What's going on here then? Oh. Hi. Well, which one's my horse? <laughs> Come on. Okay, horse racing. Everyone's just here waiting. This will be a fair race. No shooting, stabbing, cliff pushing, cross throwing, cactus grinding, neck lassoing, setting fires, or other acts that causes a rider to unfairly lose his weight or bleed heavily or black out. Get yourselves ready. Set. Go. Hello. I guess I have to win. So stick with them, stick with them. Bit of a rugby scrum, there we go. Ugh. This horse has got no stamina. Not as much as my actual one that I lost, I don't know where that went. Stay with them, stay with them. Alright, this is good, this is good, this is good. This is bad, this is bad. This is bad! Shut up, horse, and ride. mowed off the way. This horse is so slow! I 
can't even catch up with them. Damn lampposts, signposts. Oh, it's, this, this horse is terrible. It literally has no stamina. Sorry, cut a corner, cut a corner. I would just start to game on him. Oh, I want to shoot them so bad. How am I going to get past them? Let's stay with them. Stay with them. Oh, they just lose his stamina so quick. Come on, you stupid. This horse is shit. Like... Okay, I think I'm right. I think I was right. I think I'm riding badly. But it's okay. I can still pull him in. I can still pull it back. I'm having to work for this. Go, 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 go. Yes, okay. That was he tough. Came, he saw, he conquered. <laughs> what a fantastic spectacle, John. My God, that's Let's awesome, dude. Take a moment to bask in the glory of our victory. Have we got enough money now? All right, all right, all right. Uh, yes, once Seth and Irish have furnished their side of the bargain, I think we should be ready. Quite a team we've assembled, don't you think? A bunko, a grave robber, and a drunk. How could things possibly go wrong? <laughs> That's what dr dream teams are made of. Dream teams are made of these. I think this is an Irish mission now, because we finished Seth. It looks like we finished him. There is a question mark over there. Who are you to judge? Should we see what this is? You can now join horses. Games of horses. Hello. This is me. I'm gonna die alone. Hey, partner! I need your help. You and every other fool around here. No, they took her. They took my love. They stole Jeff's heart and they, they took her away. What, what are you talking they about, friend? They took my love. They took Jeff's love by them gangsters. They hide out of tumbleweed. <laughs> can oh, they're you help all, me, they're all dead. Partner, can you help me? <sighs> I doubt it. But if I head up that way, I'll see what I can do. Help a fella out, partner. I have a soul. <laughs> God, absolutely brutal. Oh, there's no stagecoach. There's one there though. So let's go for that one. And we're gonna go to Thieves Landing. I'm saying what I might do is I might do them other two little side missions before we do do salt on Fort Merced. Let's go to that point where actually we're gonna have to head to work shortly so we'll do this and then uh, we'll see what we're at. Some breakfast as well. I'm getting a little bit peckish. Might have some scrambled eggs. Treat myself. Bum, bum, bum. It's a good thing about having parents with chickens. 
lots of eggs. <laughs> so, can't say I think I should get my own chicken to be honest. Probably cheaper to maintain than fricking the cost of food at the moment. and following the roads. I don't think I was going this far. Oh, was that a... Oh, that's one of the fell flower. Very common flower. There's a sage is a brand of the rarest flower ever. Come on. I seems to be really bonding with this horse. It's a crap horse, to be honest. We struggled our way to win a race, so. Of course, still did, still managed. It's a big light. It's a big light. Oh, it's a train. That's why. Thieves landing. Thieves landing, please. Oh, at least he's got some manners. happening here. Face to face with Grand the Sun is strange. You don't even know how I feel. It's adorable. Well it's nice to see that humans never change. Well it's Irish. It's coming up. The distances seem really exaggerated on I went you inside you not inside. You're not inside. Okay, here we go. It's the only mission. Main mission oh, got that. Put them what are you doing? Irish, what are you doing? Who the hell are you? Give me that. I'm your old friend, Amnesia. Oh, I'm going to blow me. I've come to tell you. If you ever pretend to forget my name or your debt to me again, I'll make sure you reach heaven before these two ladies. Now get down there! Oh, oh, oh Mr. Marston. Uh, how are you? Better than you. Shame to know you. What the hell's wrong with you, robbing these gentlewomen and ladies of the Lord? I thought they was doxies. Oh. Ladies, I'm sorry about this man. He's unfortunately lost his mind to the demon drink. At least I hope he has, and he wasn't this stupid all along. So, uh, please excuse us. Now, Irish, that Gatling gun doesn't work. I find that rather upsetting, don't you? Oh, heartbreaking. Which is why I was just coming to see you when the drink got the better of me. Ah, come on. I know where we can find the, the parts for you. Mm -hmm. ah, mother fucking Mary. 
How about a drink or two, mister? Hello. I'll have to politely decline this time, ma'am. What you looking at? What you looking at? I can't huh? stand to see a man walk around with such a dry pecker. Oh. Can I help? Drunk as I am, my pricks in fine working order. <laughs> what a lusty specimen you are. I like Ooh, that. That fresh air's got me head spinning like a top. Can't be good for a fella. Shut up, you lazy drunk. Before I stop your head spinning with a bullet. I resent that, Johnny. Stop <laughs> calling like me Johnny. You've been working like a weasel on my behalf. True. Bushwhacking defenseless ladies of the cloth? You must have been raised on sour milk, Irish. What are you talking about? I'm a good Catholic boy. You're a booze blind coward. And you're a hypocrite, Marston. You've robbed just as many innocent folks as me. I tried to only rob those who had more than they deserved. Christ, the church has more money than anybody. Don't go getting off the beer. Your Where are we going, Irish? Us? Just Ain't to the warehouse here in Thieves Landing. Mm. I'm telling you, Johnny boy, it's all set up. We're meeting this pal of mine at the back door of the office. Hobble tongued feller by the name of Shaky. And he's got the ammunition we need? Jesus, stop fretting, will you? I know <laughs> about guns front, back, and sideways. You're gonna be real familiar with mine if things keep on this way. All right, we're here. Stay close. We're gonna need my gun. That stuttering bastard said this would be open. <sighs> Come on, let's see if we can get in around the back. I'm beginning to lose my pace. We could probably climb that. I'm unlikely. I don't know me right, I really like Arthur's story from Red Dead 2 and like how it finished and why I don't like the end result of it because but I kinda want more of him. You know what I mean? I kinda wanted more of him. But I wonder if they'll make a Red Dead 3 one day. They they don't have to, by any means of the imagination. I think the two they've got are top class. They're probably good on their own. Um, but it would be nice to have more Red Dead content. Okay. Let's go. I already know I'm going to need my gun. Shaky's made the arrangements, and he'll... Oh, oh shit. Sounds like Shaky's only gone and got himself found out. <laughs> All right. Now all we have to do is find out who you work with. You hear me? Shaky. You wretched fucking son of a whore. Suck my again! Oh. Labor relations don't sound like they're exactly... At an old time, hi. You sneak in and get poor Shaky loose. I'll go get the wagon. Good luck, Marston. He's a good man, that Shaky. <laughs> All right, work your usual magic. I'll go get the wagon ready. God. Never easy, is it? Never easy. Sneaking through the window. That window. I don't know why I had to sneak. Thank you 
for your kindness, Mister. I th 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 thought I, I was dead, man. My kindness is only as good as the bullets you can fetch up for me and your friend Irish. Let me down, and you'll be a dead man. This is always more. This is gonna be one hell of a fight. Let's head for the door. Follow me. How's that one? Sending you all to hell! B -b -b that's it! Introduce this son of bitches to your bubble up with the oh. pal, Mr. Rock! <laughs> Are you actually doing anything? You haven't got a gun in fairness. Nobody puts their hands on sh 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 Fire. Even. Half even, Shaky. You still owe me for them morphine pills to calm your nerves. Sh -sh 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 <laughs> you'll, you'll get your half. More, you d d d dirty f f f f fucking snake. Uh, b -b 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 All batter. right, gentlemen. <laughs> Let's go. Fucking. Fuck. Oh, my virgin ears. F Come on, then, Johnny boy. Let's go. Oh, sorry. Are you coming or not? I didn't realize I was. Did you have fun in there, you and Shaky? I killed a lot of men for this damn machine gun of yours. I'm sorry I missed all the dramas. You always miss all the drama. There must be cobwebs growing on that holster of yours. Someone's got to drive the wagon, don't they? Teamwork, Johnny Boy. That's my game, not just the glory like you. Everybody wants to work with me.
see from the defenders back there. Seems like half new Austin wants to be dead. They're not giving up, are they? No, but they're just wiping out the entire population of America. Like... I'm all for Thanos was right and stuff, but... You've got enough ammunition here to take down a small country, fella. I'm gonna need it. Bill Williamson's got himself an army. So I guess this is where we part ways, Johnny Marston. Or maybe not, friend. You're gonna be right alongside me when I take on that fort. After all you put me through, it's time you pull the damn trigger for once. Show me what a big, bad killer you really are. Uh, yes, of course. What am I thinking? Don't worry, you can count on me. I just hope I don't steal all your glory. Wouldn't be right or proper. Huh. Thanks, Impressive, mate. Marston. We'll have West Dickens's wagon rigged and ready to go soon enough. Good. All right, fame. Unsurprisingly, didn't get any uh, honor for that, which means we've got one more mission. Marshall Johnson, Fort Mercer. There's also these over here. So in the next episode, uh, I am probably gonna do these off camera, potentially. Um, I'll see. I'll probably do them off camera um, and just. I'll record them just in case anything good happens in them, but I'll do them off camera so they're done. And then, in the next episode, it's time to assault force murder. Oh, murder. <laughs> Mercy. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I will see you in the next episode very soon. Bye.